Yes, so we have a cold front moving through as we speak, and that means tomorrow is going to feel very different. So keep in mind, today we made our way into the upper 70s. Not the case for tomorrow. We're going to top out in the low to mid 60s, and it is going to be blustery in the wake of this front. We're going to see some strong winds. And then tomorrow night, oh boy, that is really going to be chilly. I'll show you that in just a second. But for now, here, we are seeing some of these scattered showers here. And that would be because of this front that is pushing across Maryland. I think the majority of this rain is going to move through during the overnight hours. Now, as we get a check on some of these temperatures here, so you'll notice Baltimore 72, Westminster 69, Hagerstown, you're now checking in at 66, but Oakland at 50. So actually, already starting to feel some of that cooler air there. Thank you so so much to our weather watchers working hard on this Sunday evening. So, Kristen from Woodstock, 69 degrees, partly cloudy. We appreciate that. And some upper 60s to looks like 70 on the dot there from Scott in Davidsonville, Maryland. The winds. So, this really shows us where that front is. So, throughout the day today, the winds were south southwest. But as we look here over portions of western Maryland, West northwesterly, meaning yes, that the front has moved through that area and now those winds are shifting. So the winds tomorrow, they're going to be out of the north northwest. As we run the future cast, so late tonight, so here we are, 2 a.m., still seeing some of that rain. We're pretty much done with it. Here we are, 7 a.m., it just looks like Delmarva, going to see a few leftover showers and then we're done with it and actually going to see mostly sunny skies for the majority of our Monday. Tuesday, Solid sunshine for you. Wednesday, solid sunshine for you. So we actually have a beautiful stretch of weather ahead. We just have to get through tonight, get through some of these showers. Let's talk about Ophelia. So it is now actually post tropical, however, is still going to affect portions of Ireland, portions of the UK tomorrow with some very strong winds. So there's the latest track on that, the National Hurricane Center. That was their last advisory. Now, we also have our eye on this area of low pressure in south in the southwestern Atlantic between Puerto Rico and Bermuda has a 40% chance of formation over the next 5 days. Generally, it's moving to the north. Any development I think with that system is going to be slow. We do have a small craft advisory because of the strong winds that we're expecting tomorrow because of this cold front. Now tonight Eventually, we're going to dip down to right around 58 degrees tomorrow. Excuse me, that is not 84. That should be 64 degrees normal for this time of year, 67. Our five day forecast there. So, a look at the numbers tomorrow night, dipping down to 41 degrees. Tuesday night, 41 as well. So, it is going to be very chilly. Get ready for that. Jonathan?